You're tired of peace and quiet and the normal nine to five. Drop by and meet the family. We're in constant overdrive. We rock, we swing. But what would you better than anything is raw? It's our claim to fame. Raw. It's our middle name. Raw. Life is never tame when you know how to roar. What you learn to do is there's nothing to it. Jump back and cross your fingers when the bird begins to fly. We get a little rowdy way before the ink is dry. We rock, we swing. What would you better than anything is roar? It's our claim to fame. Roar. It's our middle name. Roar. Life is never tame when you know how to roar. Hey, Leo, Leo, baby, this is the one. I can feel it in my bones. And now do it for me, okay? Do it for Sergio. All right, here we go. And action! Uh, 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 sorry, Sergio. No, 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 no. Keep rolling, keep rolling. Now, Leo, I know it's been a longer day, but this is the money, huh? Dig a deep. Man, I shall have a scene. Sometime I'm just too good a director. Great roar, Leo. Now. If only you looked as good as you sound. What's wrong with the way I look? You look tired. You've got bags under your eyes. Ooh, Freddy's right. In fact, you what? look awful. Dorothy, I'm Freddy. He's Leo. Oh, then you both look awful. Don't worry, guys. I'm fine. Well, you don't look fine. And in a couple of days, you have a big press conference with the head of the studio. He's not going to be happy if the MGM lion looks like he's about to nod off. Don't you worry, Freddy. I'm going to go home, relax, and get to bed early. No. At your house? <laughs> hey, I'm the king of my castle. If I want peace and quiet, I get it. Now, Judy, give Kate her doll. It's not a doll. It's a Spice Chick singing action figure. Tch, bet she broke it. <laughs> oh, thank goodness it's fine. <laughs> now, Spencer, take your little sister outside and play with her. Why? Unless the end of that sentence is, I'd be happy to, Dad. You better not say it. <sighs> Come on, Judy. I'd be happy to. How do you do that? Remember, I used to train wild animals in the circus. <sighs> Thank you, sweetheart. 
I promised Freddy I'd do nothing but relax tonight. There's something I have to tell you, darling. Hmm. Whoa, whoa, whoa. For cover, it's a clown invasion. Well, that's what I was about to tell you. My old circus friends, the Bells, called and asked if they could stay with us till they find a house. Stay here? I promise you'll hardly even know they're here. Shaggy, don't forget the phone in the car. Got it, honey. Lana, you know I love your circus friends, but I really need peace and quiet this week. Don't worry, they're probably tired from their trip and want to go to sleep. Hey, pal, I'm Shecky. Now you must be Leo. <laughs> gotcha. Or maybe not. Leo is <laughs> definitely a funny man, honey. <laughs> I told you that you'd love Shecky and Lucy's stories about the circus. Oh, I did, I did. Especially the one about the giraffe who fell in love with the telephone pole. <laughs> you know, they're still together. 22 years later? Never had any children, though. May I be excused? Uh, I no, really right. gotta go study for a right. test tomorrow. <laughs> Yo! Can we be excused? Bobo's going to show me how to make seltzer come out of my nose. And that's the difference between boys and girls. Sure, go ahead. Come on, Now, don't Bobo. give away the family <laughs> secrets, son. I won't, Dad. What? <laughs> Excuse me, Daddy. Bobo, I told you not to do that anymore. Apologize to Mr. Lionheart right now. That's not my whoopee cushion, Mom. I'm sorry. It's a sickness. That's why I love you. <laughs> Who'd like some coffee? I would. Yes, please. Well, um... I'd love to stay up, but uh, I have a tough work week. Hey, you don't have to explain yourself to a guy that gets fired out of a cannon for a living. Cover that up. <laughs> oh, wait, Leo, before you go to bed, you have to see the old circus pictures I dug up of Lana. Oh, I really should get to... Oh, it won't take long. Go get them, Shecky. They're in the box with the fake lips. Well, I guess a few more minutes won't hurt. Excuse me, Daddy. Wasn't she a beauty? Oh, oh, Lucy, you're embarrassing me. Oh, Lana, I was talking about the horse. I remember, Nellie. We were a great team. Except that day I forgot to clip my fingernails. Uh, oh, excuse me. You better get to bed, honey. I'll be up later. Oh, good night, everyone. I'll see you in the morning. Oh, look, Lana. There you are with that handsome acrobat. What was his name? Hmm, Carlos. <sighs> he sure had a thing for you, honey. I never heard you mention a Carlos, Lana. <laughs> Here comes Daddy. <laughs> Leo, I'm going to take Lucy and Shecky house hunting this morning. <laughs> Spencer, you be sure to show Bobo around at school. No problem, Mom. Hope we didn't keep you up too late last night, Leo. No problem. I'm, I'm off to work. The door is this way, dear. All right. Okay. No problem. No problem. I got it. Okay. First day, Bobo. I'll try. <laughs> Don't pay any attention to them. They're just fifth grade girls. Real lamos. <gasps> the kids in this school are usually real nice. I don't get it. I do. <laughs> Haven't you noticed? There aren't any other clowns at your school. I'm different. So? Kate and I are the only lions, and we don't get a hard time. Sure, you're lying. P. 
people look up to the kings of the jungle. They think clams are a joke. It happens all the time. Um, maybe they just want a closer look at your shoes. Oh, gotta go. I'll meet you outside after school. Don't worry, Bobo. Once you get to know the kids, you'll be surprised. surprised by a bully who doesn't like clowns. Who did this? We really didn't get around to names. I was too busy saying, ouch, ouch. <laughs> That's him. <laughs> See you, suckers. Bruno, well, he's not getting away with this. I'm going to make him apologize. Spencer, wait. And I didn't understand what he said. So I hit him. <laughs> Bruno! Huh? Did you beat up my friend Bobo? Your friend? What are you, a clown lover? Huh? <laughs> uh, 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 look, Bruno, uh, I didn't come here to uh, fight. Good. That'll make this easier. Bruno, don't! <laughs> I want to talk to you about your son. What? Wait a minute. Do you know who you are? Do you know who what? you are? I think I have a pretty good idea. No, no you're not. <sighs> <sighs> yes, you are. Oh, you, you're, 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 you're the guy that, uh, Leo, you know, the MGM lion. Oh, my God. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Uh, I'm, I'm here to speak to you about your son. Ah! Betty! Betty, come out here! See who came to our house! Uh, um, I, I really. Ah! Oh! <laughs> oh! Um... <laughs> Leo! Betty, Betty, Betty! Get next to him for a picture! <laughs> Bruno! Bruno, get in here! Coming, Dad! Um, do, do, oh, the come on! One picture! Now, what can I do for my celebrity pal? <laughs> um, it's your son, Bruno. Wants to be in the movies. How did you know? Bruno, do that scene from The Godfather for our guest. Try not to drool this time. You know, he is so talented. No, no movies. I'm here because Bruno hit my son, Spencer, and beat up our friend, Bobo the Clown. <sighs> Clown lover! Clown lover! You come out here. We have to talk. Go away! I'll give you an autograph. What? <laughs> well, I got nothing against you personally. Oh, I see. You think just because I'm a celebrity, I'm smart and funny and talented. You do, don't you? Yeah. You Well, it happens to be true in my case, but it's not because I'm a celebrity. It's because I'm me. Yeah. What's your point? My point is that it's wrong for Bruno to hit Bobo for no reason. Oh, I'm sure he had a reason. Why? Because Bobo's a clown. They always do something to start it. You know, that's just how those people are. But you don't even know Bobo or his family. I know they're clowns. That's enough for me. Clowns are all alike. They're loud and lazy. And they're show-offs. They don't really have big feet, you know. They just wear those shoes. Do you know how dumb that sounds? What? Dumb? No, 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 no. Look, 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 look. I, I didn't come here to fight. Good. That'll make this a lot easier. Lazy? How could he say that clowns are lazy? Why, my Uncle Mickey D owns more restaurants than anyone in the whole world. Don't pay any attention, Shecky. It's just ignorance talking. That's why I wouldn't fight him. I won't be lowered to his level. Well, I don't care. 
I'm going to go over and do this to him, and then this, and then this. Violence solves nothing. The boy's family obviously has a problem. That's how bigotry stays alive. It's passed from generation to generation. There's only one way to break the cycle. We're going to invite them to dinner. Huh? I'm glad you all agree. I'll go get the school phone list. Dad. Son, I learned a long time ago, don't question Mom when she makes up her mind. Welcome to our home. Leo! I know why you invited us here tonight. You do? Yeah. To apologize. Accept it, pal! <laughs> I'm... <laughs> uh, swell. <laughs> and my dad told me to say I'm sorry. I shouldn't have hit you. Forgiven. I should have just chased you. Why are you. Why don't we all just go around back? We're going to have a barbecue. Well, uh, first, I want you to meet some friends of ours. This is uh, Claire and Bobby and Shecky. I mean, not uh, Pappy. Wow, you're pretty good with hamburgers. Learn from my uncle. It runs in the family. Well, let's eat. Okay, here's another one. Why was the belt arrested? Because he held up a pair of pants. Oh, yeah? Well, what did the math book say to the doctor? Boy, have I got a lot of problems. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, that was my joke. <laughs> I've never met a family that knew so many jokes. You guys are great. <laughs> yeah, and you, you got to take me fishing with you, pal. I can't believe all the fishing tips you know. Well, my job took me all over America, so I got to fish a lot of different spots. Exactly what job is that, Pappy? That brings us to the special surprise I told you I had for you. <laughs> he was scared by a clown puppet when he was five years old. You weren't supposed to tell. Oh! It's okay. Everyone is scared of something. Well, uh, sushi scares the heck out of me. Uh, live dead fish? <laughs> anyway, there's nothing to be scared of. Shecky, show him who you are. <laughs> it's me, your new fishing buddy. My real name is Shecky. This is Bobo and Lucy. Hi. But, but, you're clowns. So you have to hate us? Dad, I don't care if they are clowns. I had fun tonight, and I like them. Sorry about the black eye, Bobo. Hey, it's nothing a little clown makeup won't cover. You have to admit you had fun too, Butch. I do? Yes, you do. Okay, okay. I admit it. Now that I know you clowns, I really like you. In fact, I like you more than a lot of normal people I know. Butch, they are normal. I know, I didn't come out right. I mean, uh, I, I mean, it's not like they have tails or something. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Oh. Well, I just better keep my mouth shut till I learn to be more uh, sensitive. Uh, yes, but the important thing is you're trying. Yeah, yeah. So, so how about we just stop blabbing and get on with the show, huh? Ladies and gents, children of all ages, I now present the fabulous Funny Bell. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Brooch, did I tell you that the bells were moving down? 
Yeah. Yep, and I found them a house right next to yours. Couldn't think of better neighbors to have. Ta da! <laughs> Nice work, Lana. You always know what to do. You don't do so badly yourself. Mm -hmm. I married you, didn't I? <laughs> Time for dessert. Pie, anyone? Ha, 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 ha.